Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. All right, let's check out that forecast this evening. We are looking at temperatures in the upper 20s, dropping down to about 26 by 11 p.m. So once again, just one of those nights with a very slow drop off in temperatures. But we get a little sunshine mixed in with the clouds at times. Tomorrow should boost highs up around 40 later in the day. Still dealing with that cloud cover tonight and Tuesday. As I mentioned, we could see the sunshine mixed in there. And there's a football game tonight down in Miami. And uh, kickoff temp 70 for the uh, college football playoff championship. Championship game, Ohio State and Alabama going at it. Won't be much different there at halftime with a light southwest wind. We're going to find some milder temperatures in our area for the middle part of the week. And then along comes Friday and winter makes a comeback. Colder temperatures and it looks like some snow showers in the air, not only Friday, but also into Saturday. There's that slow drop off in temperatures tonight, heading down toward the mid 20s, around 24 for about 4 to 6 a.m. High temperatures tomorrow, generally around 40 degrees, 40 or bad. 39 Springfield around 42 in Troy 40 degrees or so here in the Dayton area and high temperatures on Wednesday even warmer getting up into the mid 40s over most of the Miami Valley. We'll stay with the mild temperatures or well at least for January standards uh, mild at least into Thursday but here comes that Arctic air for Friday and Saturday spreading back through the upper Midwest the Plain States into the Ohio Valley and the Great Lakes. So it looks like winter is going to be back as we get to the weekend and even into early next week. The Bryant Heating and Cooling Systems camera. Watch, did you see that sun right there? Well, at least it was out for about maybe 15, 20 minutes. And then it's right back to the cloudy skies. That's what we're dealing with right now. And rainfall totals for the uh, month, you can see there, and also for the year now, two-tenths of an inch along with the melted snow. And snowfall for the month, three-tenths of an inch. So we're about 1.4 inches behind on the snow. But most of that rain, that all generally fell right around the first day of the month. And since then, it's been pretty dry with just a few hundredths of an inch from some of that melted snow that came through last week. Live Doppler 2 HD, it is dry tonight, but you can see the clouds still out there. Thinned out a little bit for a while, and there are some breaks in the clouds in northern Kentucky and southwest Ohio, but those breaks are few and far between, and we'll stay with the partly to mostly cloudy conditions through tonight. Right now in Dayton, we have a temperature reading of 28, west wind at 10. Feels like 19 degrees, and our weather checkers tonight, Jeff Cador, Bell Center, 27, along with Jason Thompson in Brookville, and Barbara Richards in Kettering, warmest number we have there at 30, and uh, looking at uh, 28 over in Jay Jamestown reported by the Lowsteaders. We'll see some clouds around tonight, probably a little aggressive on the future track forecast. Aggressive here moving some of those clouds out tonight, and we'll see that mix of clouds and sunshine through the day tomorrow, but should have more sunshine Wednesday. Tonight we drop off to 24 with a southwest wind, and then clouds mixed with a little sun at times tomorrow, and chilly high temperature up near 40 and a bit breezy. 20s in the morning, mid 30s at lunchtime with upper 30s to near 40 in the afternoon. We're at 45 Five on Wednesday, partly sunny, partly sunny and windier conditions on Thursday, 48. A cold front comes in Friday morning. Rain showers going over to snow showers, snow showers on Saturday and cold with a high near 30 and a slight chance of snow showers on Sunday.